This is Dr. Clayton Lane and in this video I'll be demonstrating the Mako Robotic Partial Knee Replacement. So what is a partial knee replacement? Here we have x-rays from two different patients. On the left we have tricompartmental arthritis of the knee. So the medial, lateral, and patella compartments are all affected. On the right x-ray we see isolated arthritis of just the medial compartment of the knee leaving the lateral compartment, the patella, and the ACL and PCL normal. Therefore there's two very different solutions for these problems. The patient on the left would have to get a total knee arthroplasty while the patient on the right could get the less invasive unicompartmental knee arthroplasty which would preserve all four ligaments of the knee, the lateral meniscus and the patella, and only resurface the affected compartment. So our case example today is an under 40 year old patient with osteonecrosis of the medial femoral condyle, which means the bone and cartilage have died, and unfortunately he has a contraindication to transplant procedures. Therefore, we chose the unicompartmental knee arthroplasty or partial knee replacement. So we got a CAT scan of his knee and I'm able to do my preoperative planning on the computer and tentatively plan where we're going to place these components to best serve the patient. Now, when we get into the operating room, as you'll see, we'll fine tune the location of these implants to adjust for ligament balancing as well as what's called cartilage mapping. In the OR, the first thing we're going to do is tell the computer where the knee is in space by registering 50 to 60 points on the tibia and femur, as you can see here. Then we're going to assess the ligament balance of the knee through all ranges of motion. We're going to use that information, as well as the information from cartilage mapping, which you can see here, to fine-tune the position of the implants on our computer model. We're then going to pass along all of that information to our robotic arm and begin making precise and minimally invasive cuts to remove the focal arthritis of the knee. Once our cuts are complete, we will ensure that the ligament balance is perfect by placing trial implants and taking the knee through our range of motion. Here with the final implants in place, you can see that the metal is perfectly aligned with the healthy cartilage and that our lig ligament balance is normal. Our post-operative x-rays show how only the medial compartment was resurfaced and minimal bone was removed. And here's our patient now at six weeks post-operatively with full range of motion and a fairly cosmetic result. So in summary, partial knee replacements provide a bone sparing, less invasive treatment option for arthritis. The Mako Robotic Partial Knee Replacement provides the most precise technique available for matching the patient's ligament, cartilage, and bone anatomy. In my practice, partial knee replacement has been effective for patients anywhere from 30 to 75 years of age. Thank you.